hello everyone welcome back to my channel um in this video we'll be doing something different something that does not involve a drill so um i'll be flipping this beautiful table uh, i got it off facebook market for a very reasonable price so um i didn't like the hard on wood on it so i decided to just give it a bit of love give it a bit of a, a popping color that will go hand in hand with my decor at home as well so stick around and see exactly what I do and all the steps and how to go about it. Stay tuned. Here's the list of materials that I use for this project. Um, a wood sander, which I put an 80 grit paper on it, a masking tape and also a top coat and also a color of my choice. I don't even know the name of the color. I'll put it on the description. The first thing that I did was to use a sander which has an 80 grit paper on it um, and to send the top of the table um, I spent a lot of time sending the top of the table because I needed it to be a bit lighter than um, the color that it is now so I was sending the legs I realized they were a bit delicate so I didn't go extreme on them so I gave them a little buff and um, that was, that's all that I did I didn't go extreme on the legs So the second thing that I did was to use masking tape to cover the edges of the table. So throughout the table, I put a masking tape. Uh, this was very handy because I needed a two-tone uh, finish on the on the table. So I needed to keep the top as it is. I needed it not to be t uh, tinted with the paint or the spray that I, that I was gonna use. Um, I achieved it, but it was a bit tricky uh, putting the masking tape on. Uh, but at the end of the day, I finally managed to do it. I needed to make a few adjustments when I was doing this. Um, initially, I wanted to put a primer to the legs before putting on my initial paint color, but uh, my primer spray failed on me, so I needed to come up with a different alternative. So I decided to just use my paint. Um, so it needed me to put more coats than um, I anticipated. Because my primer spray failed on me, so I needed to spray paint the table as it is without the primer. Um, so I needed to do multiple co uh, coats onto the table. So this is how the first coat looks like. Um, so I moved on to the second coat. So I wasn't much concerned about the bottom of the table because uh, the spray paint was getting less and less and I only had one bottle. So I just put a bit of a, a spray paint to cover the, the brown pot, but I wasn't too much concerned about that. After I was finished painting the legs of the table, um, I took out the masking tape around and I realized one of the corners was not fully covered. So it wasn't a big deal, but um, there's a bit of paint on the corner of the wood top. Uh, it does look nice even with the paint on it. So the final step what I did was to put a clear and matte finish uh, clear coat. Uh, I spray painted it all over the table and then I just, so that it mustn't be too glossy, I just wipe it off with a cloth. We are all done. The table looks amazing. It's beautiful. I love the color, even if I don't know the name of the color, but it's beautiful. Um, this is one of my favorite projects so far. It's amazing. I love it. It will go hand in hand with uh, the house decor as well. Please do try something like this. Try flipping your furniture at home. Uh, it's not everything that we need to throw away. So um, do something like this. Do something different. Um, thank you so much for watching. And please remember to share this video with your friends and family. Cheers. Bye.